Today I went to see the doctor for my checkup. He's just started using a new computer system called the Virtual Physiological Human. They call it the VPH. I was intrigued. A nurse led me into a room with a huge hologram screen. After a brief hello, the doctor started gesturing at the screen. A 3D model of a human body appeared, and when I looked closely, I realised that this computer body was breathing and moving its eyes. In response to a command from the doctor, it started to jog, and after a while I noticed small drops of sweat forming on its brow. So this was the virtual physiological human. The doctor made the skin on its chest transparent, and I could see the heart beating and the blood flowing. But still I didn't understand what this had to do with my checkup. Then he asked me to undress and to stand on a platform. A laser scanned my body. Suddenly the model on the screen changed, and it was me. It was my size and shape. It even had my face. With another command from the doctor, all my skin blemishes appeared on this virtual human, some of which the computer had marked in red. He picked out two moles on the VPH, and a robotic arm came out and found them on me. On the screen, an enlarged picture of each mole appeared. The doctor attached some sensors to my skin and explained that these would transmit signals to the computer. Then the VPH started to breathe with me. I held my breath and the VPH stopped breathing. I touched my wrist and I could feel the beat of my heart synchronised with that of the VPH. Weird. The doctor asked me to mount an exercise bike and start pedalling. I could see my muscles contracting, my joints articulating, my heart beating. He zoomed into the heart region and told me something required further attention. I started to get nervous. They took me into another room for an MRI scan. Then back to the screen, where my heart model was now huge and there was lots of detail. The doctor studied it and then told me everything was fine for now, but the computer had predicted that I could have problems in the future. He showed me a thickening in a vessel and told me that if it increased, it could disturb the flow of blood to my heart muscle. Maybe I didn't look sufficiently impressed because he called up something on the screen which he said was a worldwide database of cardiovascular diseases, searched for a while and then showed me another heart with a thickening like mine but much more pronounced. The blood flow was obviously reduced and the heart was beating in a very strange way. It was clear something was seriously wrong with that heart. I got the message. No more bacon sandwiches for me. He gave me a memory stick containing all my data, some dietary recommendations, and a cardiovascular training app for my phone. It was quite an experience. Now I'm all set for a healthier lifestyle.